So the following speech was a speech assignment that I had to do in speech class. And this was one of the many speech uh, speeches that we had to do. Um, I recently, maybe like a month or two ago, did a speech competition and I came in third. Um, and I just did it just to step out of my comfort zone. Um, um, and I'm also sorry that for this video, um, you won't be able to see the audience. Um, this recording w was sort of uh, last minute, but I plan to film other speeches that I have in the future. Uh, one of uh, 41, 114. Uh, one of uh, 14, and the section is uh, t t t 21, and my name is uh, Lorenzo uh, Sir. So, a good morning speech class. I will speak before you as a first person testament of stepping out of my comfort zone. My name is uh, Lorenzo, and this speech will be about why you should step out of your comfort zone and how. This has helped me. Uh, so, as uh, many of you guys know, I have a stutter, I have a speech impediment. And having a stutter can be so complex and draining. The weight of depression, anxiety, and fear were on my shoulders throughout the whole day. My mind was full and clouded was full and clouded with uh, the limitations of my stutter. Now, we all may have these self-limiting beliefs about ourselves. If it manifests as fear of public speaking, reluctance to pursue your dreams, or reluctant to embrace change but we must be conscious of this and we shall choose to grow um, outside of your comfort zone are fertile grounds of growth shielding yourself from stepping out of your comfort zone may prevent a failure but it it denies the transformative power of progress. I have been shown these grounds. My comfort zone was me not speaking up. My comfort zone was me uh, limiting myself if it was mentally or speaking wise until I made the conscious effort of stepping out of my comfort zone and having new experiences um, for my mental health and for my stuttering. And it feels so freeing to defy expectations if they were expectations that you may have or other people that are, or that are, that are like around you uh, may have. Um, and with all that being said, now I will present the scientific side of stepping out of your comfort zone. So there is a term called a neuroplasticity, which basically states that you can change your brain by having new experiences and new exposure. Um, this is a quote by Susanna Callahan, who is an American author who writes about her mental obstacles. Our minds have the incredible capacity to both alter the strength of connections among neurons, essentially rewiring them and creating entirely new uh, pathways. Also, according to uh, Harvard, some benefits of leaving and stepping out of your comfort zone are achieving your goals. It helps with um, self-confidence. 
it expands your world, you build a, a resilience and self-agency. Now, I want you guys to have a vision of yourself. Have a picture in your mind of you pursuing your dreams and pushing your uh, limitations. That vision is a, a reality and that reality is right outside the zone of comfort. This is a quote by Oprah. Create the highest, grandest uh, version possible for your life because what you be become is what you believe. Now, starting today, I want you guys to declare belief in yourself and go out and adventure the grounds of new experiences and growth. While you are making these new experiences and growth, you will you will also be making new connections in your brain. So starting today, I urge you to step out of your comfort zone, no matter how big or no matter how small. Thank you.